the USS Kentucky of 1898. The USS Kentucky, second of the two Kasages, a pair of a very unremarkable and not altogether successful battleships. Constructed for the US Navy in the last years of the 19th century. The US Navy took a remarkably long time to come up with an effective design for a battleship until the year 1900. Their capital ships were far too small and attempted far too much. While the Kasages and the name ship was only the US New Navy capital ship, not to be named after a state, were by no means as bad in respect as the prototype Indianas. They were still far from satisfactory and they were unstable and had far unnecessary complex weapons. That included one feature. Superimposed a 13 inch 330 mm stroke 8 inch 203 mm turrets which trained together. They certainly did not live up to their expectations. The two ships of the class were built side by side by the Newport News shipbuilders. This was not entirely unusual but the fact that they were not laid down on the same day the 30th of June 1896 but also launched on the same day the 24th of April 1898 certainly was USS Kentucky later the BB6 was commissioned on the 15th of May 1900 rendered obsolete by the advent of the dreadnought she was an uneventful career and she was eventually sold for breaking up in 1923. The basic flaws of this ship from the outset, the Kasages were far unstable. They had unstable gun platforms, one of the most serious defects from which a battleship could suffer due to the considerable amount of top hamper they carried, modifications carried out between 1909 and 1911 which removed the six PDR guns and added four more 5 inch 127 millimeters on the superstructure didn't improve matters at all even though the military mass were replaced by lighter lattice mass so overall she was an absolute dreadful ship she had a range of 8000 miles she had a speed of only 16 knots which compared to you know the German and the um, um, English boats at the time was not very good at all it's a good job the Americans didn't have a falling out with the English or German in that period um, she had a weight of 12,850 tons but all in all I'm pretty sure that <laughs> looking at the stats of this ship that a shipping boat might have been a bit better than this but anyway that was the 1898 Kentucky and I'm pretty sure American ships are a lot better than these these days anyway thanks for watching please like comment subscribe and I try and read these facts as best I can thank you bye bye